Hi guys and welcome to Rube's Game in HD. It's Mr. Old School Campbell here. And check this out. What the fuck? Look at that guy. What is he doing inside the wall? Look at him. There he is. The hunter somehow jumped at me and then ended up glitched inside the wall. Now I don't know if this has happened to you a lot before. But if it has, could you leave me a comment with your strange occurrence? And I'll see you on the boss fight. Right guys, here we go. Now I would suggest using two LMGs or the chainsaw which I'm carrying and the Alsat because it's got 100 bullets per clip and you need it against the breeder. I'm just working my way down the steps here. And here he comes, if you see him coming over the ledge there. Here he comes. And you just aim for his mouth, you just shoot at his mouth constantly until he goes down and he reveals his well it's part of his neck or his stomach I think it is but you've got to stay out of the way of that machine gun those machine guns because if he hits you with that you'll fucking know about it and stay out of the way of those red bombs that he's shooting at you as well because they leave this red residue and that injures you as well I'd love to hear your thoughts uh, what you think of Nightfall if you think it was a decent decent episode and are you looking forward to the to the next one which is supposedly supposed to be on some sort of ship and the boss on that one will be a kraken some sort of giant octopus i think it is so now i'm just throwing down some armor and he's shooting his machine gun so you gotta get out of the way again and you just rinse and repeat basically guys you just keep shooting him but you gotta watch out for the, the little bastards that are around you to take them out as well and oh, there he is there they are again so I might be doing this on hardcore with my mate, hopefully maybe in a few weeks time, I can't guarantee it, but hopefully we'll be able to do it and get up for you. So and here he is again, I think he's, I think I'm getting quite close to him now because I know he's going to go down any second, there you go. And you got to keep, just keep shooting that yellow thing, just keep shooting it constantly. Yeah, and half of his, nearly half of his health is gone now, so I think he gets a bit pissy here and fucks off. I think he does. Yeah, there he goes. Look at him. Cheeky bastard. Yeah. I'm injured, so I'll just go on a fag break. <laughs> Cheeky fucking bastard. Yeah. Just get some fucking nicotine and then fucking recharge my batteries. <laughs> but I get my Venomex out here. I'll just show you what it's like. Uh, it's got two shots per clip. And it's very powerful. But you see this Rhino. I hit it once and I hit it there again. And it leaves a residue. And he's down. Straight away, he's down. So it's pretty fucking powerful, and I know it's been, um, I know it's been, oh, I know it's similar to the acid blunder gap from Black Ops 2 and Mob of the Dead. I've heard on a lot of forums online that people are, uh, well, you know, they're referring it to that. But I'm just taking out the, um, taking out a few enemies here, and uh, waiting for him to get back off his fucking high horse and come down and face me again. The chicken shit he is, fucking pussy. But another thing, once he starts getting down, like he's on half health at the moment, I just get rid of these here, just, you know, take him out. But once he's on half health, he starts to regen. And that means his health will start going back up. So you got to just keep trying to shoot him. And that is another one of the new bosses. Well, not a boss, he's just a new alien. And it's called the Phantom. And he, uh, he uh, disappears when he jumps at you, so you've got to be very careful. And he's quite powerful as well. But you do get a nice thousand points while taking them out. So that's pretty fucking sweet. But again, it's just rinse and repeat, guys. He's down again. So you just aim straight for his gut. Take him out. Lovely fucking jubbly. Just keep shooting, keep shooting. Take him out. Now he's down. He's really low down. I've nearly got him. But now he starts to regen. So... <coughs> I think I'm after he's so low now I'm running after him because I think I'm going to get him here. But now I get those f fucking explosive red fucking things. You know, take a lot of fucking health. So he's regen now. He's got that yellow, sort of like yellow ring around him and it makes him regen his health. And he's gone back up. Just chucking down some more armour. Now, a lot of people use armor piercing as well, but I, I, t I used explosive on this one because I heard online that explosive is supposed to be quite, uh, it's supposed to be quite powerful. So I usually use armor piercing, but 
but uh, I went for explosive on this one. My house getting quite low now, and he's firing up machine gun at me a lot longer than I anticipated. But there we go. I just keep shooting him. He's nearly fucking down. He's nearly dead. Just keep keep going. Just get at him as much as possible. Keep shooting the fuck out of him. Just keep shooting him. And I think it's getting towards the end of the video now, guys. He's nearly dead. So I I hope you've enjoyed this. I hope it's, it will give you a chance and a tip and some tips on how to take him down. Like I said, we will try and be getting some hardcore footage. That is the end. I think he's down. Yeah, he's dead. I think he's nearly in. He's still alive. <laughs> My bad. But he's nearly dead. He's nearly dead. Look, I'm just taking so much damage because I'm trying to finish him off. But he's nearly down. Oh, look. Trying to fucking hit me with his fucking feet there. Cheeky bastard. Of course. There he is. He's down. That's it. I hope you've enjoyed the video, guys. We will be trying to bring you some hardcore footage in the coming weeks. And, yeah, I'm just, yeah, mission accomplished. There you go. And I will see you on my next vid.